This is Mission Control Houston. Good morning. Today is Tuesday, November 14th, 2017. We are live here inside the International Space Station Flight Control Room awaiting the capture of the Cygnus cargo vehicle for Orbital ATK's OA-8 mission. Right now, the Cygnus cargo vehicle is just about one and a half kilometers away from the International Space Station and approaching. It just initiated its uh, third burn uh, to approach the International Space Station, what's called the Approach Initiation Burn. Still a little bit out of view, but coming towards the International Space Station for a capture time uh, scheduled now at 3.50 a.m. Central Time. Cygnus now at the 250 meter holding point. Uh, station is 258 statute miles above the Earth, just east of Australia over the uh, Pacific Ocean. Now crossing the Terminator line into orbital darkness, yet still illuminated by the sun. You can see the outline of Cygnus uh, from this view and the solar arrays at the bottom. The International Space Station, about 252 statute miles above the Earth, uh, just passing north of Maine on a southwesterly uh, course, sorry, southeasterly course, uh, towards the um, uh, Atlantic Ocean. We're starting to see some uh, illumination from the sun as it passes the Terminator line into an orbital sunrise. You'll start seeing the uh, view here of the Cygnus cargo vehicle start to light up. The vehicle itself uh, crossing that 100 meter mark. Um, now at about 78 meters away from the International Space Station. And station on two, we can confirm, we want you to confirm 30 meter hold and set up for capture per step six in 1.102. Station copies, we can verify a hold. Prior range 30.52, secondary range 30.52. Flight controllers uh, just flip the camera to its um, to get a better view of the station's robotic arm and Cygnus. Again, Cygnus holding it about 30 meters away from the station. You can see the tip of the station's robotic arm uh, there, sort of toward the center of your screen. That's where um, Cygnus is heading next after the go for departing the 30 meter holding point. It'll go just about around the range of uh, 10 meters away from the International Space Station, about 10 or 12. Um, that'll get it into its position um, almost perfectly. So Paolo Nespoli just has to push the controls forward. Uh, and right there, you can see the latching end effector will, will grab the um, Cygnus vehicle. Cygnus passing uh, 15 meters away from the International Space Station, now in view of the station, um, the robotic arm, the camera at the tip of the robotic arm. Slowing down the approach rate to about 0 0.03, uh, now less than 0 0.03 meters per second as it gets closer to that capture position. Cygnus now right in front of the station's robotic arm. Holding it around 12 meters away from the International Space Station. Three meters away from capture. Two and a half meters.
Now two meters away, everything looking good so far. Now over the pin, in the capture envelope, with that the carriage is driving, and driving the final commands to capture the Cygnus vehicle 404 AM Central Time today over the southeastern Indian Ocean, just southwest of Australia.